So today I'm going to be doing a review on this BBR LaFerrari Aperta in metallic white. I've had this model for about two or three years now and it's limited edition. I, I think it's 36 worldwide. This is number nine, I believe. And it's honestly one of my favorite models in my collection. Very rare. I haven't really seen one on the second hand market in this specification in white. Um, I think they made a red one, a yellow one, a black one and a grey one. But this metallic white really, really is such a nice colour. I remember seeing one of these in London in real life and I just had to get one in the model. So as you can see at the front of the car, it's got the mesh at the bottom, full carbon front splitter, very nice Ferrari emblem on the front. The headlights are done amazingly and you've got a very nice black pinstripe running across the bonnet, around the interior of the car and it runs around the engine bay as well which I'll show you guys later does come on this very nice stand from BBR as well. All models like that now come from BBR. Highly recommend this model to add to your collection. If we turn this model round, like that, there you go. Now from the side profile, it just looks really, really nice. The wheels are done very well. Nice detail on the brake calipers. You can see the Ferrari emblem. Nice detail on the discs as well. The only downside with this model and the money that you know you spend for these models that there's no tire writing as well. I'm sure. I mean, I don't know on the real car, but I guess it would be nice to see some tire writing, like MR do sometimes and other auto art signature models have an um, tire writing as well so small problem but nothing really serious with the car very very nicely done coming around the model again zooming out very very nicely done the full mesh grills where the door is as well Back wheels done very nice as well. 70th anniversary emblem on there. Coming around the back of the model. Really nice detail here. Full carbon fibre. Rear spoiler. Great detail on the lights. And just really, really nicely done. I mean, nice F1 reversing light. Full carbon fiber diffuser in the engine bay as well is done in carbon fiber. I'm not sure if you can see that. There you go. Really nicely done. You can see quite far down as well. It's um, nicely done. Very nicely done. I have no real problems with this model car from BBR. It's been absolutely flawless and it is one of my favorites in the um, in my collection altogether. So coming around again, yeah, this is number eight out of, out of 36, so quite rare. 36 models, as I said, I've never seen one on the used market before in white. The interior as well is just phenomenal. There you go. The steering wheel's done very nicely. Full driver carbon fiber zone, carbon fiber on the steering wheel. You have the Manantino, the start stop button, some other Ferrari indicators. All the seats are lined in white as well white stitching, white seat belts. You even got the little Italian flag there on the center dash in between those two air vents. All very, very nicely done. Very detailed interior. Again, on the um, rear tyres, very nicely done, but no tyre writing, no detail on the tyres at all. As I say, I'm not sure if that's on the real car, but it's 
Some other models have got tie writing on as well. Again, detail on the brake calipers. Very nicely done, very realistic. And I would just highly recommend this model to add in your collection if you can find one online on eBay in white. It is a no brainer. I think it looks absolutely phenomenal. And I'll probably never ever sell this model. It's a keeper. So I'm going to be doing more of these kind of reviews on the channel, a um, bit more in depth. Um, talking through some of the good ups and some of the downs on each of the models that I own. Um, I've got a few, I've got about three or four models on pre-order at the moment as well so I look forward to having them on the channel and I'll be doing an in-depth review and first look on them, some very exciting models. But for the meantime, this is one's just for the start and I thought I'll start with quite a good one. So thank you and subscribe to the channel.